share something that my friend here did today that was really awesome. So he was kind of stuck. He had a hard time figuring out what he wanted his small moment story to be about. So when I sat down with him, I said, what was something that happened this morning that we could zoom into? And he started to write a story about, do you want to share what your story was about? Uh, one day the bio trucks came. Yeah, so he's writing a small moment story about the time that the fire trucks came, okay? In Mrs. Marsh's first grade class, students were working on storytelling, specifically small moment storytelling where they zoom in on something that happened to them and they relate it to their real life experiences and to the rest of the class. That's my one of my favorite parts about being a first grade teacher are those aha moments and when they're able to work through the times when they're struggling and um, persevere and come out with uh, writing a piece that could be difficult for them at times. What other letter makes that sound that it could be under? If it's not under K. <gasps> Find C. Came. I see it. What letter do you hear first? So what would house start with? H. Look on your H and see if you can find house. I see it. And happy. What do you hear? What's book. that last sound? Book. Oh, do you hear a buck and happy? Happy. What do you hear at the end? Happy. H and B. Happy. They are lifelong learners. They love to learn. They come in every day excited to learn, which just makes me excited to teach them and get to see those aha moments that they have. Just really makes my job so rewarding. A blend that starts with snow, snow, like snow. Can you find snow? Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. What? So what do you hear next? Snuff. Oh, what makes the O oh sound? So what would come next? One snowy. 